Welcome to the Nickel Harpa Effect. Today we have chestnut or dove's figury. They couldn't really decide what to call it, so it's called either or both, or in fact, chestnut or dove's figury. That's its full name. It's in cut common time, 2-2, two, two. so it's two beats in the bar. Nothing difficult, just remember your B flats. We're going to go down onto the G string with an A sharp and then an A. It goes like this. One, two, two, two. or dove's figury. So I'm going to talk through it nice and slowly. Starts very simple. You can either stretch your third finger onto this C sharp or put your fourth finger up to you. Essentially it repeats it. Part. So the pairs of quavers I'm slurring out so as often as possible I have a down bow at the beginning of the bar and I don't bow everything out. It kind of feels very so that's why we put the slurs in just to make it a bit more musical. But to add a bit of variety, bar 13 there, I'm not slowing the last one. Now I'll play it through nice and slowly. I count four crotchets in. One, two, three, four. probably sped up through that and we need some nice string crossing so we're crossing A to G so really watch that and if you're getting any catches or grumbles or scratches kind of keep practicing that until it all absolutely matches up so that is Chestnut or Dove's Figury. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.